I'm Michael Pierce, 84 Lock Road. I'm not here to talk about Kino. I'm sort of neutral on that. <clears throat> I'll be referring to Article 9 on the warrant. <clears throat> it is uh, $1.5 million to make one block of Lafayette Road in Hampton Pretty. The purpose of this article, which includes features such as ornamental lighting and sidewalks with granite curbing, appears to be primarily beautification driven to benefit only those businesses that are on that block. Taking $1.5 million from the road fund will clean it out and push other road repairs further down the road. The voters approved $1.1 million last year to address the sewers and repave the road essentially in the same section of Lafayette Road. <clears throat> that project is currently a work in progress and there is 113000 of that money left, and the town manager has indicated to the budget committee there's plenty of money to repave it this spring. John Nyan, experienced Hampton's president last year, said at the budget committee's public hearing last year that money for this project would come from state or federal funds. Article 9 only asks Hampton for Hampton taxpayer money. Lechman Bridal, who's a director of Experience Hampton and whose son is also an Experience Hampton director, as well as Lechman Waddell, whose wife is an Experience Hampton director, voting to approve this year's Article 9, nine there is an, an, apparent, an apparent conflict of interest. Apparent conflict of interest. There was only a 1% margin with the voters uh, at the ballot in last year's Experience Hampton's article. The Budget Committee voted in favor of it with a close 6-7-6 six, six vote, and there are only three selectmen that recommended last year's article on the ballot. This year, the selectmen discussed Article 9 for all of 46 seconds before approving it 5-0. to zero. During that discussion, Article 9 was characterized as to repair and rebuild the roadway along with some drainage improvements. No mention was made of the or ornamental lighting or the fact there was plenty of money left in last year's $1.1 million article to repave the road. It appears to me that town officials are quietly funding my major elements of the Experience Hampton proposal from last year using funds that the voters thought they were approving for the maintenance of our roads. In closing, I recommend the voters to vote no on Article 9 for the above reason. Thank you.